welcome to Potter's training video on how to set up reporting on the peer-to-peer -peer network panels. Once you have your individual control panels configured, you can then navigate to that particular control panels tab up here at the top and choose the control panel that's going to be set up for reporting. And I'm going to choose the first floor. Then you can go down to either dialer or IP reporting. If I choose dialer, I'll click add dialer. From here, we can add our account just like we normally would. Don't forget to check mark the boxes for report, trouble, supervisory, and alarm conditions. From here, everything else is standard besides the new addition of panel selection. So if I choose panels, now I can choose which panels are going to report to this particular account. So if I want all three panels to report to the same account, I can check mark the box for all three, then click OK. Or if I want each panel to report to a different account, then I can select this and make a different account for each control panel just by adding another account and then now selecting that control panel for the other account. The other addition that's been made here is under the primary reporting format. If I choose this drop down box, is now you will see SIA Limited. So there's Contact ID, SIA, and SIA Limited. SIA Limited was added for the purpose of reporting via a cellular communicator or a radio system. What SIA Limited does, instead of sending a larger packet of information, it breaks it down into smaller packets, so that way it doesn't overwhelm those communicators. If you plan to report via a dialer or radio, you will need to choose SIA Limited if you plan to get any sort of point information, if you're just looking for general signals like trouble, supervisory, and alarm, you can choose contact ID. But again, in order to receive point information off the particular control panels, you will have to use SEA Limited. Now, if we navigate to IP reporting, you can choose add IP reporting. Again, add the account, choose the control panels you would like to report to this particular account, and then click OK. Now, while under the IP reporting, you only have two formats for reporting, just contact ID and SIA. Contact ID is only going to get you general signals. You will need to choose the SIA format if you plan to utilize point ID. For more information about the peer-to-peer -peer network panels or more information about their Potter products, please contact tech support at the email address or phone number shown on the screen. And as always, don't forget to follow us on social media.